been taking a lot of the STEM and design classes in high school now because I was introduced to it in middle school. And she went above and beyond in everything she did with Lego League and design classes and STEM classes. She put time in outside of the classroom and you could tell. Well, really, like, there's so much to do and the projects that she has us do aren't really, they're specifically like what you're supposed to do, but there's like so much you could do and they're not like as like structured, I guess. Not only is she committed to, you know, her day-to-day -day routine within the school day, but she puts in uh, unmeasurable hours for students to pursue um, STEM related activities outside of the uh, classroom. So co-curricular, um, she also, she coaches boys basketball, she coaches cross country. Um, she just, uh, not only within the STEM field, she, she impacts a lot of our students who are in this, who are in this building. Um, and uh, I just think she's an excellent role model, um, once again, for not only our male students, but our female students. And, um, there's never a shortage of kids who are interested in STEM activities and a large part of it's because of Terry Smith. It's kind of a weird story how I got here. I was an art teacher and then middle school STEM opened up and um, actually a, a teacher told me I should apply for it because they thought I would enjoy it. And so that's kind of how I got to where I am. So I started out as an art teacher and just saw a lot of correlation between STEM and art. And now to this day, there's so much creativity in STEM that I'm using all of my art background almost every day within this classroom too. So it's getting the notes later on from the high school kids or the college kids that are like, oh, you, you, you made me want to do STEM or want a career in computer science. I have, there was one student that is in Iowa right now and she got some award and she, my name was listed on like one of the reasons why she went into what she, the computer science. So that, that makes me happy. And then I just got another card the other day from a graduation present. And again, it was like, thank you for introducing me to all this stuff. You know, this is what I'm going into. So seeing that, hearing that, that I made a difference in a couple kids' lives, like huge differences um, that I like that. Thank you, Kim and Industries and the Iowa Governor STEM Advisory Council.